All right, guys, so today I wanna to walk you through how to change the background or the wallpaper on your Mac computer. So I'm demoing this on a Mac Studio, but the steps are gonna line up on any type of Mac. I mean, the settings, they're always pretty much the same. So uh, super easy here, actually. All you need to do is open up your system settings by hitting this Apple and clicking system settings. Alternatively, you can just right click on the uh, screen and open change wallpaper. And it's going to open up your system settings, but directly to the wallpaper section. And that's where we need to be. Now we have a bunch of options here that Mac gives us. We have dynamic wallpapers. That means that this wallpaper is gonna change based off of different things, right? Like time of day, system status, whatever it may be. Then you have these other wallpapers that have this little play sign here. And that means that they just have some movement. So whenever I unlock my computer, the background is just moving slightly, which just gives it a little bit more flavor for lack of a better word. So these ones are super, super cool. To switch your wallpaper, you just need to select which one that you want here, or you can add a photo um, or download one from the internet that you like. Now I will say that the download process is not quick. It will take, you know, a few minutes, which I guess isn't terrible, but uh, let me select a new one. I always go for the landscape. These are my favorite. So I just clicked it and you'll see that this is now loading here. And once it's downloaded, it will change. Now there are other options here. I was just playing with this place. This is a uh, dynamic wallpaper dot club. I'll put the link in the, uh, in the description below, but they have a bunch of uh, different dynamic wallpapers here. And just like clicking through them, they're pretty interesting. So here's just more options if you want to, you know, get a more custom look. And these are free, which is cool. So full disclosure, I did have to go in and allow the pop-ups from the site so that I could download this. But now that it is downloaded, to install that one, all you would do, oh, it changed to Patagonia Lake, that's great. Um, but we would go into add photo, we would choose a photo, we would go into our downloads and get that Fuji, and then we would select it. And just like that, we've downloaded this one from that website, Just cool, I like it. Um, now you also have other free resources like Pexels. Pexels, you can download images for free. You can go in here and find some static wallpapers. So I'm just gonna put Mac wallpaper. They have a lot of really cool options here as well. So if the, that wasn't enough, you can check out Pexels or Unsplash is another really good one, unsplash.com. I'll throw these uh, links into the description as well. But yeah, that's how you're going to change your Mac wallpaper. One other thing, if you're working with multiple screens, I am currently only working with one, but if you did have extra screens, you would just see those up here and you could just change them any which way you wanted and it would be all good. So, hey guys, I hope this helps. Again, if it does, like the video, subscribe to the channel and I'll see you next time.